I want to have a central uh, fuel storage here so I can distribute fuel to both of the harbors and uh, to the rail system and let's try if you can make it work here so um, I want a fuel loader and unloader please uh, this one not This one, yes. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Hmm. So in is this side. Let's see. Are we straight here? all right compared to this one <laughs> yeah measure one quad cut twice or how does it go oh that's the wrong kind of railroad we have no money for this. Okay. So this one will block a little bit the traffic. Uh, because it's a one way. So everyone goes in here and comes to this one. But um, because it's of distribution of a thingy, it's okay. So the distribution office will pull fuel if it's needed. Hmm. I like it. Let's see. No. Hmm. Make it first the outer and then the inner. We'll have an easier time. The game wants is helpful like this. <laughs> Let's say it this way. Um, it's highly unusual that the game is helpful in the rail building business, um, but in this situation it is. So it allows to have. I have made this trick before. It allows to have a sharper angle. Nice. I like it. Okay. Good. So, yeah. And I always, if I build my rail lines, I always think about in yards. So, uh, you know, here is a corner and also it's a connected yard. So I have a very little, in, uh, little interruption in my railroad. The same way here. I don't want to have um, crossing after crossing after crossing. Then you run into problems. You need to have longer railroads and have sparely crossing so think of yards and uh, concentrate your business into yards um, this one i don't like super much because you have one so you have one big block here then you have another big block here then you have the first crossing which is always a disturbance and uh, provides two problems then you have another crossing here and then you have the whole this one is the will be one big uh, junction which is no problem because Either it's a train in here or a train goes here around because it has refueled or whatever. And the only thing which is not super elegant is this one, which needs to go uh, over the rails. So if I would have this business on the other side, it also would have worked, but uh, it needs to be here because of the bridge and uh, because of the waiting block in front of the border. Um, I hope you can follow, but yeah, this was the thinking behind it. And my knucklehead brigade it looks good. Okay. I think I can start to uh, signal up properly this situation here. Um, let's see. He wants to go... In, he still needs to finish this one. Wants to go in and out here. 
but he also can move in here and zigzag back in. But I think if you want him to zigzag, he does not do it. He only does it if you don't expect it. So let it be. We will revisit the situation shortly. Okay. Mm, so. Ooh. No. No ooh. <laughs> oh. Um, okay. Let's assign everyone so we are sure that work is done. Yeah. And wait with the people. Okay, they are working on it. Done. Good. I really like it if the canals don't look horrible. Um, but you don't see them, so... <laughs> yeah, but... Let's give them some people if they don't have one. How many do you have loaded now? Ah, nearly full. That's great. Also, the trick is if you use the small stations and the big uh, suspensions for the cables, you can use the big gondolas. If you use the small station and the small suspensions, um, thank you, Kachip. Also, for this one, um, you use the. You can only use the smaller gondolas. Um, I had figured it out, but honestly, I forget about this because so many details in this game. So I wanted to be sure that <laughs> I don't build the wrong kind of station. Um, yeah. So he's on the way. Okay. Oh! Maybe he is full. Um, let him wait and he waits until unloaded. Okay. So she. Hmm. Don't know why, why he's cruising there. Hmm. Eh, it's okay. What should go wrong? Okay, central fuel storage. So, we have our pumping thingy here. We have two harbors which need fuel and fuel comes here over the bridge. So we can have a fuel exchange point here, which will feed the, f uh, the rail system and uh, we can change our strategy because the fuel exchange point at the moment is this fuel station, which is on an ingenuitive level okay, but uh, on a sustainable level not so much. Also, maybe I want to have some helicopter business in the future, which is also helpful if you have some. So, where do we want to go? <laughs> I think that's okay. Again, just to be sure. Everyone does his work. Okay. Yeah. Last stages. Mm hmm. You feed directly without pump. Very important. <laughs> This one. Okay. Go. Um, then we have the two harbors. This one and that one. They have a range, which is our constraint. So, mm, you stop here. 
Let's see if we can make something work here. Okay. You don't want to go anywhere. It's bad. Oh no. Um, you stop here. You stop here. Near this one. Can you go here? You can't. You won't. You want to go deeper? Maybe the road is in the way? Mm. Oh, I think... No bueno. Let's try. So, if I have an underground pump... Which is one entry out. Hmm. Next to you, oh no, what a shame. Um, I don't know if I want to build two pumps for this stupid business. Maybe I have to. If I build you... Mm, a little bit skeptic about the road connection. I'm also skeptic about my people connection because... Uh, yeah. It gets crowded here. Yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No. No. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Game. Why? Why? <laughs> Okay. Challenge accepted. Um, Freaky pop business. I will, uh, will teach you how you can work here in the Soviet Republic. You have no other choice than to go in here. I don't know if this will help. No. It is really... ...that close.
But I don't think the upper one will go then. You, yes. And you know. Meh. Meh. Mm. Yeah. Mm. No. There's no common ground. I can put you in here, but you need a pump. Spoiled thing. Um... Let me first think about this one. If I if I put up with this business, or so comrades simply don't get the pump. <laughs> mm. In the end, I think this harbor will be. No, oh, they're both. But this harbor is way busier than the other one. Also, I need more people. So, yeah, my construction business is really pulling out people. And my pulling out people business is pulling out people. Uh -huh. Yep. Shows is tall. I can export raw bauxite for fun. Where are you, second ship? Oh, I see. Do I need this desperate money? I don't think I don't. Uh huh. Mm, this is hell. High water. Oh, don't want to do that. Um. If anybody gets the idea, oh, should also write a number. CO. Hmm. Okay. Ah! Yes! Okay, this one should also help with our worker situation because he is on outer side? No, he isn't. What do you do? Plumbing. Interesting. How do you get your jobs? Hmm. I think... Yeah, okay. I think you shouldn't be getting your jobs, my friend. Um... Can I assign construction office? So, uh, can the construction office yet? So, yeah. Oh, cancel construction. Mm. Reading helps. Cancel construction mode. Yeah, but cannot. Ah, which number are you? For thinking, reading, all at the same time. Hmm. Okay, you are extremely unbusy, but now I can move you. That's what I'm waiting for. Um, you go in here. Mm, I think you can go on auto search. Thousand meters. Um, what do you do? You do the plumbing here. Okay. I also want you to move and also do some auto search. What should go wrong? We know the game. <laughs> um, but uh, they both need a source of workers. Uh, 
and the big bus office, I think I will pull you out um, a moment. So, no more workers for you. And if you are done, you are done. Maybe I will pull them out partially. Let's see if our fantastic pipeline business here in our super complex field is going. Yeah. Super fast. Yeah. Don't stress yourself. Okay. Okay. They are on it. Good. Completely relaxed here. Mm, we determined your name. Yep. Okay. Hundred workers. We are on goal. Um. We are exporting, yeah. Good. So this one will bring in the sweet money. If it bring in, brings in sweet money, it will bring in also sweet sickness. Yeah. <laughs> 75 years. This is a little bit more realistically what I expected. 74 years. But it's okay, honestly. Uh, as I said, if the population is between 70 and 80 years, you are more or less on a non-population growth situation. If you're under 70... Let's say 70 years. Um, you are on population minus. And. Ah, look at that star. Um, and if you're over 75, you are on population plus. Uh, but I can look with the fact that this. This village does not bring me any additional population to the roster. So my super nice town is there for population growth. This one is simply to go to work, comrade. And uh, work good. <laughs> yeah. And uh, with the amount uh, this this thing works at 10%, uh, 20%, 100 or 500. Yeah. That's the goal and it achieves this. What? Uh, oh, it sucked out all the oil. So. Chop chop. No time. No rest for the wicked. Yeah. Mm. I forget forgot if they are all connected to Yeah, they are all. But that's the end of the line for our um fuel uh power business, so I maybe want to have another power supply here. And extend the power situation. Of course, I think you don't suck 40%, yeah. So we can easily uh, connect the second one up. So, yeah. You have got your monuments, you have got your nice fire and hospital, and your auto scooter. So, happy comrades. <laughs> uh, 89%. Yeah. Yeah. Just tell me, why do we build the indoor swimming pool? <laughs> no, really. These things are crappy. Um, there's only one worker here. So, if there are zero workers, uh, no one gets served. And if one worker is gone, then there are zero workers and it's bad. That's why I place them right in front of the working places. Because if uh, somebody ends the shift... The next one is hopefully starting as fast as he can, so they get a good spot situation out of it. Um, yeah. Next thing is auto scooter, which is a magical device. I don't know really what it does. The people either want attraction or prey or something else, and attraction is a filler thing, I think. If they get nothing else, they go for attraction. So you see here, here is no prey. Um, but all in all, it makes them also happy in a kind of way. So, yeah. I'm not complaining too hard. Um, mm -mm. Good. 
good. Ooh. Yeah. So. Hmm. Mixed signals. They are already mixed signals. What are you talking about, Dennis? So... You are not a good idea. Yes, I know, I know. Um, you are a good idea. Should be a chain. And this way. You should be a block. Block, block. And a block out and a chain in. So let's take a look what we have done here. So a train can move in here and can go back there this way. And he will stay in his in his in his block because he can't go away, which is a good thing. Yeah, so he has this uh, shining block here all for himself. And he will not go into this crossing if he can't go out because it's a chain signal. And the chain signal is only he will only go here if this one is greenish. Um, do I want to move this one a little bit closer to the... Uh. Mm -mm -mm. So, yeah. Okay. And after this one, this is the true rail line. It can also be a stop rail line. Uh, but after this one, they sort each other out and they go on their merry way. So, yeah. This is why I think now my little knuckleheads will go quite a long way faster mm. because they don't get into each other's way and maybe they drive take the hill a little bit faster hello um okay next situation so He can go up that way. A block is nice. Um, chain in. It's not really a in, but I think I will treat it as a chain. Um, this traffic is super, super uncommon. So chain out. And here, no matter what happens here, it's all okay. Um, chain in. So really, really, really nobody blocks it. I had. I hate block junctions. Um, okay. Next one. This one will go away. Uh, 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 uh. Don't like you here. You mess up the system. Um, like I said, uh, do not try to prevent too many junctions. It uh, makes your life harder than it should be chain right head side traffic chain here you there you okay um mm -mm -mm. and here it's one big junction so if a train can be in the junction it should be in the junction for him alone so we separate this junction here and there okay do I need to have two-way traffic here? Because... Mm, hopefully you aren't confused. Um, ah! And I better remove the contradicting signals. Um, let's block this one off so they don't block each other in a stupid way. Um, can remove you? Okay, do I have a situation? If I go to the border, you can... Yeah, this one needs to be two-way because I want traffic from the depot 
Oop. Ooh. Mixed? Yeah? Okay, yeah. I want to have traffic from the depot to the uh, border to let me pull out vehicles. So... I also go mix here. Yes. And separate out this one like this. So this is a big block. Which is all nice. And this is a two-way block. Which is a little bit risky, but it only is uh, if I have depot traffic, which should be very uncommon. Mm. Hello. Second helicopter. In my opinion, or uh, what I have experienced, you better have two helicopters. One helicopter is nice, but um, yeah, they have a longer route. Let's see. Um, here, if they are flying up to the mine, it's not so big pleasure. They should be in range. Yeah. Okay. Good, good. Hmm. Road is on the way. I want to have... Oh my god. Let's re you here. All of you. Um, and I want to have some smalls here and to speed up the trip road. Hopefully somebody's on the way. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, okay. Good. You are done. It's nice. I bet you you are working for workers. Waiting for workers. Um, okay, our construction workers are busy. So I can remove these two. Oh, good. Yeah. Worker situation picked up. The the one construction office here really drained my stuff. So are you all... Looks, 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 looks... Let's make you three. You are my special worker operation group. Uh, way bigger buses than I used to. Um, I really like my mini buses to have no auto search. Um, to have a constant supply. And with a road crane, 20 people are enough. This will provide me with 40 people so I can speed up bu bigger buildings. Uh, no, wrong. It's freaking symbols. <laughs> Um, like you so I can pump in 80 workers and uh, just make the process a little bit faster okay dokey my super happy alcohol town 90% <laughs> I um, I assumed I would have a happiness, uh, let's say, around 70%, because uh, really no cinema, you know? So, no culture is a big thing usually. But it seems they are all listening to our radio, our propaganda, alcohol is rising, which is not good for their health, but uh, 72. Yeah, I think they are poisoning themselves with a nice refinery. But hey. We need to make money. All for the mother Soviet Republic land. Yes. This really takes time. Fascinating. This is also a piece of art here. Mm -hmm. and I think uh, because of the mud roads and stuff. Eh, get the right one, Dennis. 
Okay. Export backlog is clearing off, which is also good. 120 workers. So you see how efficient it is because I have no public transport. They simply go to work if they need to. Strange concept, I know, but um, you really make your people more productive if you save time. Hopefully the shop sees it. Yeah, shop sees it the same way. Good. Everything nice and peachy. As long as I have 12 people because of the big uh, fire truck outside, uh, I never got a fire which uh, wasn't extinguished. If they arrive in time, so in snow or something, it can be complicated. Okay, good. Oh, not good. You load everything, and how are you called? Schwedivitz? Schwitz? Schwitz? Schwitz. I go with Schwitz. Um, also, greeting to my Polish population, uh, Polish viewers, comrades. Dzień dobry. Um, you are one of the biggest groups. Good job. Um, mm -mm -mm. Gas station. Aha. Aha. Now it makes sense. Yeah. This looks like a good convention of trucks and people. Eight tons, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Thank you. Ah, uh, some nasty bugs with trucks and people. And ooh. Central fuel storage, here we come. Okay. Can also add you to the list and assign you the right way. What about that? Mm -mm. Yep. And there goes our export of fuel <laughs> and bitumen for a time. Okay. Good. So, many small improvements. I think our uh, canal line up. Ah! Let's pull you out. Um, before we go. Before you go in circles and never stop. So, we have here 74, like the doctor ordered. And what do you do? Hmm? Pleasure cruise? Please don't. Um... Good. So, small steps on our big uh, project. <laughs> um, yeah. And I hope you see you next episode and have a good one. Bye, comrade.